Hi everybody, this is Christine. Welcome to Scrap and Rabbit. This is another journal that I made. This one is a little bit smaller than the other journals. It measures about 5 inches by 6 inches and it is about 2 and a quarter inches thick. Now it's a different size but it's made the same way as I show in my tutorial for my beaded spine album. This is made out of fabric only I used um, a faux leather type fabric and you can see the exposed stitching on the spine. I didn't put beads on this one. I like the look of just the plain spine showing as well. So that's why I attached my beads instead to this little eyelet. And on the front I've got a button closure and this is just an elastic like that that's tied to two eyelets on the back. And I had these little tin ornaments that I attached to the front and here's my my trim and on the inside I've got some some more trim and this is just um, a plain white burlap type fabric that I attached on the inside got some lace here and there's a little pocket on the front and on the back this one has six signatures attached to it so you can see these six signatures here and again I used some leftover paper from different projects so these aren't all from the same paper pad this is really pretty it has some glitter on the design and because it's a smaller album more compact I've got my charms on the outside here I've got a little little wheel little heart and then I've got some some beads on here so I didn't attach any charms to the inside and all of my tabs are made of cardstock so you can write a title on here and I use some sheet music that I have and again it's a combination of coffee stained and just plain sketch paper I think this is pound weight so it's thicker than regular printer paper. So I'll just take you through it quickly. And here you can see where I attached in the middle of each of the signatures. I didn't seal the pages. And this one I did seal to form a pocket. You can put um, some pictures on here, use these as photo mats. Again, there's the cording where I tied my signature. I just left that dangling like that. You can always trim it smaller if you don't want it that long. there are 20 pages per signature that you can write in. So with the six signatures that's 120 pages. So quite a bit of journaling space for a small journal. And there's another pocket. So these are a lot of fun to make and Especially when you make them into smaller size, you can use up a lot of your leftover pieces from past projects. Or if you make a mini album with a paper pad, you can use the leftovers to make a coordinating journal that goes with it. I'll be listing this in my Etsy shop and I will include a link in the description of this video. Have a nice day. Bye.